An alleged serial rapist accused of attacking women for more than two decades finally is in jail tonight. The DeKalb County District Attorney says Wesley Cooley is linked to sexual assaults dating back to 1999 here in Metro Atlanta. Caitlin Ross was there today when Cooley's arrest was at long last denounced. The alleged attacks spanned years and miles around DeKalb County, Atlanta and Conyers. And the district attorney says she's sure there are more victims out there. That's why she's asking everyone to look at these three different booking photos of Wesley Cooley throughout the years because people may have encountered him at different times in his life. He was denied bond at his hearing this morning with a judge ruling he is a significant danger to the community and would likely attack again. The remand comes after years of attacking women with the victims ranging in age from 15 to 38. His DNA was collected after a sexual assault in Tucker in 2017 on North Wake Parkway. The DA says the DA links him to a total of five assaults in DeKalb, two in Atlanta, and one in Conyers. Today is about the victims on whose behalf we advocate. Victims who for too long have been marginalized, not believed, forgotten, and hidden in the shadows. Today we say, we see you. We will continue to fight for you, to seek answers and justice on your behalf, no matter how long it takes. The DA says they got a break in this cold case after the state received a federal grant to clear a backlog of untested rape kits. At six, we're looking at how many charges have been filed since the state got that much needed funding. Thanks a lot, Caitlin.